Depositing checks. Can you do it for someone else? Hello, viewers. Today we're diving into the topic of check deposits. A common question that comes up is, is it possible to deposit a check into someone else's account? Let's break it down. What's the standard protocol? Typically, when you receive a check made out to you, it's intended for deposit into your personal bank account. The name on the check should match the name on the account. This ensures security and prevents fraud. However, there are circumstances where you might wonder if you can deposit this check into someone else's account. Can you deposit into someone else's account? The short answer is, it depends on the bank's policy. Some banks allow this with proper authorization. You might be required to, one, endorse the check by signing the back and writing, pay to the order of account holder's name. Two, have the account holder present or provide their account details. However, many banks have tightened their policies due to concerns about fraud and now prohibit third-party check deposits unless you are a joint account holder. What are the risks involved? When depositing a check into someone else's account, there are potential risks. 1. Fraudulent activity. If the check bounces, the account holder might be responsible for the overdraft fees. 2. Privacy concerns. The deposit receipt might contain the account holder's account information. 3. Misunderstandings. If the bank doesn't allow such deposits, you or the account holder might face unnecessary complications or delays. It's always best to check with a specific bank and ensure you have the account holder's permission. In conclusion, while it is possible in some instances to deposit a check into someone else's account, it's essential to know the bank's policy and understand the risks involved. Always communicate openly with the account holder and make informed decisions. Hope this video has clarified things for you. Stay informed and take care.